Today, I will share with you the incredible story of Sid Finch, the pitcher who threw 168 miles per hour, but never played a game in the major leagues. Yes, this guy was going to be the greatest baseball player to ever do it, but he had one big problem, which cost him his MLB career, and you'll find that out today. Sid Finch was just a regular person, or so we thought. Nobody knew who he was until one day a Mets scout was walking through the city of New York and spotted a man with a baseball in his hand. He appeared to be about to throw it at a soda can, which was standing about 35 feet in front of him, standing on a ledge. Sid reared back, chucked it, and the soda can exploded. The Mets scout saw everything. This man had just thrown a ball the fastest I've ever seen. He had never seen a baseball thrown that fast in his life. He thought the ball may have traveled at nearly 200 miles per hour and the biggest thing was that it hit exactly his target. The scout immediately called the Mets and told them they had found a guy. This man would carry on the Mets to win a championship, he thought. Sid met with the Mets and they watched him throw. Zoom, pop, right into the catcher's glove. The radar gun picked up 165 miles per hour. Again, he pitched it into the glove, 170 miles per hour. All 20 pitches were strikes and in the 160 to 170 mile per hour range. He was looking like an MVP, but Sid Finch had the biggest problem that would force him to never play an MLB game. He wasn't real. Yup, you heard me right. The story of Sid Finch was all a myth, a tale, or a prank. ESPN posted the article about Sid on April 1st, which is also April Fool's Day. If you look closely at the first letter of every single word and put them together, they spell out Happy April Fool's Day. So, that is the story of Sid Finch. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe for more baseball content.